السلام ورحمة uh, الله وبركاته. شيخنا الكوشن واز بيسيكلي وي ار بجت اند وي بري دي اصل تايم اكوردنج تو ذا وان شادو لينث بت ان اور كوميونيتي وي هاف بيبل هو فولو ذا اذر اوبينيون ذات ذا اصل تايمز كم وين ذا شادو لينث از تويس سو ذي ار فولوينج ذا هانفي اوبينيون اند ذي ار ريفيوزينج تو باي بري وذ ذا كونغريجيشن اند ذي هاف ريكويستد اس ويذر وي كان ديلي ذا جماعه تايم so that they can pray with the jamaah but the starting time will remain the same but the jamaah time will be as such that Akhi, they can pray with us no. as well because Akhi, if, I understand where you're coming from the vast majority yes. of the scholars are of the view that based on the hadith of Jibreel the time for Asr begins by the end of the time of Dhuhr when the length of the shadow is the same length of the object itself Imam Hanifa says when the length of the shadow is twice the length of the object itself. So if the community, you know, dominated with the Hanafi madhab, and I'm a newcomer and I found them, mashallah, they call Adan an hour after the actual time or they pray us 45 minutes after, no problem, join them and you're not blameworthy, it's still within the time. But if I'm a person coming from a, a Hanafi background, two or three or four families and the masjid mashallah is running according to the opinion of the vast majority of the scholars which is the correct view then I should not request or demand them to delay or postpone the time of the prayer the more correct view is the opinion of the vast majority of the scholars based on hadith of Jibreel alayhi salam when he came to the messenger of Allah in two consecutive days uh, where he led him in the prayer Fajr, Dhuhr, Asr, Maghrib, Isha. The first day he led him at the earliest time of each prayer and the second day at the latest time. And he said between the two times you can pray each prayer. May Allah guide us to what is best.